So we got a call for a car that is stuck out here on the east side of Sand Hollow. We're gonna head out and see if we can get it. We got Skeeter here. Good morning, guys. Rode the moto out early morning to meet Matt. Yeah, he had to meet us here. It's nice and cool. It hasn't got too hot yet. We got the dogs with us. AC still not fixed in the banana. It's not that bad right now. Oh, no, it's nice right now. This is the time you want to be in Southern Utah. It's the mornings and late nights. Should we use point. that? Since it's not stuck hardly at all. Let's go for an early morning swim. Yeah, we, we came in last night and we didn't like Wait. see that it was so soft. So we slept on the beach under the stars. Uh, there you go. <laughs> You've got a recovery point in here. The question is, can we get to it easily? Okay, I'm happy to move that stuff. Easy actually to move. Ah, uh, it's not worth it. Okay. We'll go under. <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be worth it. The suspension is just oh, yeah. way too spindly. All right, we've got to find the recovery hook. You've never seen such fancy luggage before, Matt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're we're going, from Southern we're Utah. We're doing a whole so. cross country trip. <laughs> yeah, we're driving to New York. Awesome. Oh wow. Yeah. This was day one. Yes, day right. one. <laughs> Do you guys tow people out here all the time? All the time. All the time. Makes us feel better. Yeah. Everybody like has the same disappointment. They're like, I was gonna have an epic road trip and then we got stuck. And it's yeah. just part of your adventure. It's, like, like, it's fun. It's fun to meet the different people and like hear their stories and stuff, like what they're doing. And I'll put you in the car. Okay. Reverse, basically no gas. Unless you need to. Fully bellied out here. Fancy. Where's the push button on this thing? Right here. Oh look it's a lever. Turn the wheel to the left. Right there's about. Look at your steering wheel. About turn it straight from there. dogs a little bit of a run out of here after they cool down we're gonna just kind of drive along the shore and nice slow pace they can get in the water get out we're trying to get lady to lose some weight she uh, went to the doctor the dog doctor because we don't say that they said she's 10 pounds overweight Ed soft hearts causing lady some problems <laughs> all right let's go for a run dog the water's deep enough, both Lady and Peanut will actually dive under the water. Come on, load up. Max, you stay in the back. Good dog. Hey, Lady, load up. Oh, you lazy dog. You are the laziest dog in the world. It's no wonder you're fat. I can't believe I'm doing this for her. <laughs> All right, that wasn't too big of a deal. We just got hooked up to it and pulled it out, sent them on their way. So we got a call for a Jeep that is stuck out here to Sand Hollow. They got themselves buried in the sand and we're gonna go see if we can get them out. We 
We got Lizzie here with the weather. It's a beautiful day. It rained last night, so the sun is shining. We got a little bit of humidity in the air, but it's gonna be a good day. So Skeeter met us here at the gate. You can see him back there. What up, Skeeter? What up? Good morning, guys. I'm gonna see if we can do this in two-wheel drive, just for fun. All right. Done quite a bit of digging, you guys. Yeah, we yeah. did. Yeah. We thought we could maybe try it out. As soon as we broke through that top layer, it just it sunk. Yeah. It, it's all in there. It's in four low. Yeah. Okay, what do you think? One pop or two? Two wheel well, drive? We're in two wheel drive, so I'd say two. What do you think, Matt? One. Thank you guys. Appreciate it, Matt. Thank you. That was awesome. <laughs> Be a little sandy. <laughs> All right, we got there and we got them pulled out. It wasn't too bad. This sand, when it gets wet like that on top and then it's still dry underneath, if you break through that wet crust, it's kind of like breaking through a snowmobile track. Once you're through it, you're done. It's over for you. But anyway, we got them out, got them on their way. So we got a call for a Nissan Titan out here to Sand Hollow. They are stuck in the sand. We're gonna head out here and see if we can get it out. We got Ed here. Yeah, it's a little cloudy. Probably rain this evening about 75 degrees and we'll find them and get them out got the rest of the crew back there including oh, got peanut. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. i can take a nap like this too yeah. seriously <laughs> hey matt do we get the day off to go to the lake yes after six this is what we're getting Yeah, it's wet. Yeah. You get down below and it's dry. Yeah. It's in four already. Alright, Lizzie, we're gonna just go around this way. Actually, go around this way. Pretty easy for that thing. Well, that wasn't too bad. No, no, I appreciate it. Okay, there you go. We'll get them out. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Uh, this calls for a celebration, Dr. Pepper, I think. Celebration, Dr. Pepper? Why not? You're tired. Come on, load up. Let's go. Oh, you licked the top of my Dr. Pepper? <laughs> that's, that's your I ain't drinking that's it. it. All right, that wasn't too bad. We got there, got them pulled out, sent on their way. It was a good day, just like we thought it was gonna be. Yeah, he was happy. He got a shirt. <laughs> Matt won't let us go swimming. Yeah, he's in a rush to get back and work. So we got a call for a limousine that is stuck in some soft 
gravelly driveway situation. We're gonna head out there and see if we can get it out. Yeah, it's pretty clear, a little cloudy, no wind. It's hot, we might get some rain. The humidity's high. exactly an off-road recovery. Maybe. Not exactly, <laughs> but just when you think you've seen it all. I wonder if they rent it out. I could use that. I could take Jamie on a date in it. helpful not to be bothered by spider webs. Okay. You got a big a big subframe right there that's bolted down really good. As long as the angle here on this rear bumper isn't too bad, that will work nicely. Sitting there a while. Yeah. You got it from here? Yep. Okay, what size shirt? You gonna wear it with your next client? Absolutely. <laughs> That'll do. Awesome. Appreciate you guys. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. So we better mark one of these down, Ed. Yeah. What number is that? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 66. Well, what do you think about that, Ed? Yeah, that was fairly easy. <laughs> You gotta know not park it in the gravel. Glad it started. It help. We got it out of there. Thanks for watching. Is that your first limo? I'm trying to think. <laughs> it might be.